With the start of Lent next week, the 2022 annual Catholic Appeal for the Diocese of Springfield is also getting underway. The appeal helps to support more than 40 ministries and agencies right here in Western Massachusetts, offering help to all ages from infants to our seniors. This year, in unison with the Year of the Eucharist, the annual Catholic Appeals theme is Transformed in Christ. Carolyn McGrath has more. And we have them each decorate a portion of it, and then as a group, they put the heart back together. And Therese so Ross is the executive director of Rick's Place in Wilbraham, which provides free grief support to children and their families. Rick's Place is named after Rick Thorpe, a Wilbraham resident who died in Tower 2 of the World Trade Center in the terror attacks of 9-11. The nonprofit offers facilitated peer support groups in their Wilbraham location, and with the help of the annual Catholic Appeal, they are able to provide free peer support groups in local schools. We have kids in the school groups that the annual Catholic Appeal funding supports where they will say to us, I wouldn't have come to school today if this group weren't happening. So the connection is really real and we couldn't do it without the funding. Rick's Place is one of 45 agencies and ministries supported by the annual Catholic Appeal. So what we know, just for a little context, one in 14 students in Massachusetts will experience the death of a parent or sibling by the time they're 18. And those are pre-COVID numbers. So in the time of COVID, we're seeing an increase in caregiver deaths. And we know that when kids get together in a peer group, they feel as if they're with a group of others who understand their loss. The Diocese of Springfield launched the 2022 Annual Catholic Appeal, or ACA, with the theme of Transformed in Christ. The goal this year is $3 million. The 2021 campaign raised $2,882,000, topping the 2020 campaign by more than $330,000. We're very blessed at the reach in this appeal. Um, this appeal benefits all four counties. Um, it benefits people um, from in the womb to children, to young adults, to families, uh, to people at the uh, late stage of life. Um, in addition to helping people in their faith with different uh, faith formation programs and different young adult programs um, to helping their needs like hunger and um, homelessness uh, and clothing the poor. Some of the other agencies the ACA supports include Bethlehem House, a crisis pregnancy center in East Hampton, and Homework House in Holyoke, which provides after-school help and summer programs. The theme of the annual Catholic Appeal, Transformed in Christ, is directly related to the year of the Eucharist because, as Bishop Byrne has said, the ACA is truly Christ's love in action. We take something as simple as bread and wine and it's transformed into the body and blood, soul and divinity of Jesus, which then again you and I, when we receive, are transformed in Christ. And so it is from that we are then called to transform the world to bring Christ to others, especially those most needy. And that's what the annual Catholic Appeal does, is it provides all of our social service and all of our ministries a chance to thrive, to transform the world into Christ. Transform the world by providing a hot meal, warm clothes, and light in what can sometimes be a person's darkest hour. Reporting for Real to Real, I'm Carolee McGrath. For more information on how you can support the annual Catholic Appeal, we have a secure link at diospringfield.org. And Catholic Communications, which produces Real to Real and the Chalice of Salvation, also benefits from your generous support of the annual Catholic Appeal. So we thank you in advance for your 2022 gift.